Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. <laughs> okay, so for Sunday, I at 8 a.m. Pacific, we have the moon newly moving into Taurus. And uh, you can see that Mercury here, where's my chopstick, actually? Mercury retrograde here is in a really nice trine over to Jupiter. And the sun is moving forward uh, every day to exact that trine. But for now, Mercury retrograde is going back into an exact trine to Jupiter. And that should bring through some optimistic uh, thinking to make plans, uh, especially for your own personal security, safety, making money, abundance. Uh, I'm speaking now to Jupiter and Taurus. Taurus has everything to do with, you know, just the earthly, blissful uh, happiness that we can create. <laughs> yeah. And then later on this evening, I think it's about 6.30 p.m., uh, Venus retrograde actually goes direct. It stations uh, direct. So we'll, we'll be looking at that tomorrow. But let's see what the cards want to bring through. Okay, so we have the... Um, hold on, I can bring this down a little. There we go. We have the Knight of Pentacles. So we're in that, uh, well, you know, maybe a slower moving. <laughs> it's Sunday after all, right? We were sleeping in, and it's so nice to sleep in uh, if you can, uh, or even if you can't, you can lounge around in bed. Oh, my goodness. And then to have the sun card coming through. Uh, it, it, now, if you're on vacation or traveling, this could be a really nice, like, waking up to a lazy uh, you know, wonderful earthly experience, and then the sun the sun comes up, and you maybe you get up early and you get to see the sun rise, and oh, I love that. Oh, I, lo I absolutely love sunrise and sunset. They're my favorite times, and and then we also have the page of pentacles. My goodness. So on the very practical levels, this could be like I said, getting up, enjoying the sunrise getting up, enjoying coffee, getting up, being very happy about your life, and then maybe you're studying or making plans for the future. Maybe you're hanging out with younger people who also love, you know, having lots of fun with you. <laughs> That's so awesome. But, you know, most of all, so just to go over the meanings, uh, I allowed for reversals, no reversals today. But with the uh, Knight of Pentacles uh, coming through in the upright position, that can bring through something where somebody's very committed or you're committed. There's reliability and dependability with this card. It's, you know, it's of, it's of the pentacle. So it's everything to do with, uh, you know, body, finances, everything in the physical realm, basically. There's no limit there. Uh, so let's see. And then with the sun, that is the highest energy card in the major, well, in the whole deck, in the major arcana, that's the highest energy card. In the minor, it would be the Ace of Wands. So the sun has to do with um, happiness and joy and lots of life force flowing through you in, in a good way, you know, health, basic health. And um, success is another one of the key words and like we were saying before you know warmth because we do you know with the sun that's where we get our our warmth and our life without the sun we wouldn't we couldn't do it <laughs> right so it's about all things positive and then the page of pentacles is kind of like the knight of pentacles but it sometimes they bring in news you know in, in the old days they were the messengers you know all the pages were messengers and it's just it would depend on, um, you know, which suit it is. You would adjust accordingly. But uh, with the Page of Pentacles, that's our card for someone who's ambitious. Uh, there's loyalty with the Pages of pen, the page, all the pages in the upright position. But especially dependability, just like the Knight. You know, there's not a lot of difference going on here. Um, but yeah, and sometimes too the because you you have to look at the images. There's there's that looking up to some opportunity, so there could be some new opportunities and some good news that comes through today. Uh, but yeah, what an awesome day! Uh, moving towards goals is very um, apropos with both of these bookends here with both of the pentacles. Yeah, wonderful. 
and you can see the the red uh, you know it's like a scarf and a hat he's got going on there man <laughs> so there's the connotation of a little bit more life force coming through although this guy has you know he's wearing red as well but whenever you see red in a card you think life force you think first chakra you know health life force so yay okay have a wonderful day you guys let me know how it goes for you bye